Hey, what's up guys? It's Fattenage. Welcome back to another Minecraft video. Today I'm showcasing my uh, Stone Factory version 2 map. Uh, before you play, make sure you go to your settings and then go down to uh, language and turn on English United States. If it's on a different language, then some of the features won't work. And here's the world. Um, it has a lot of add-ons in it. Um, I only added my add-ons, so if you want, you can download the recommended add-ons for more features. Um, but there's a bunch of stuff with just my add-ons, so uh, let me join the world and I'll uh, show you what's in it. So basically you start off in a small little cave, kind of, and the entire world is just a big, uh, a, a big flat stone area, so if I go into creative and try mining around as you can see it's just stone uh, there's nothing else other than stone and if you try to go up uh, it's just stone and if you try to go down you only get stone so yeah and if you go into uh, so to get started you break these like cracked stones all over the place and you'll get uh, pebbles and with these pebbles, you can turn them into cobblestone. And um, with the cobblestone, you want to make a... First, you want to make a crafting table. And you can put it wherever. And you can make a crafting table out of stone. Basically, in most things in this mod pack uh, that use wood has now been replaced with cobblestone. So, yeah, you can... Uh, make a bunch of cobblestone and you can make sticks with cobblestone and the first thing you want to make is a hammer so let me get a little bit more uh, pebbles and now I can make a hammer so let me turn my pebbles into cobblestone and here's a stone hammer so with this you can mine the stone around you and you can get uh, gravel and you can also, you actually should have made a, you should make a pickaxe first, just so you don't run out of cobblestone. Um, but I, there's enough in there for a pickaxe as well, so I can make a pickaxe. And with this pickaxe, you can make cobblestone pretty easily, and just mine it in the walls. And there's infinite cobblestone, like the, the whole world is made out of stone, so you can get infinite stone. And, uh... With the hammer, you want to collect a lot of gravel, and um, you can make a sieve. So this is how you make a sieve, um, just like this. And as you can see, we have a sieve right here. And when you place the sieve down, you can put gravel inside of it, and it will give you a bunch of resources. And you can use all of these resources to make a lot of cool stuff. Um, I'm going to go over some of the things you can make right now, so down here, um, so let me go over some of the uh, stuff you can make. So there's basic machinery, so you can make a lot of like power generators and stuff. The first thing you probably want to make is this quantum miner. This will automatically produce ores, and you'll also need to power it with like a solar panel, and you need a power cable to connect them. Um, there is the Christmas presents add-on, so you can make this Christmas tree, and it will generate presents that are kind of like lucky blocks. Um, there's element exchange, so you can make these uh, element blocks, and these basically let you convert some items into other items. Um, there is um, the furniture add-on, so if you want, you can make like chairs and tables and stuff. Um, and then there's uh, weapon cases, so you can get weapon cases from killing stuff, and they have a chance to drop a weapon case, and you can upgrade them and get really cool weapons. Um, there's refined storage, so you can make this and uh, some other blocks to store uh, a lot of items. There's baubles, so you can craft these to get like permanent status effects. And there's also element, I mean, uh, there's Android infusion and this is basically the same as baubles and the stats combine So you can use like a sword arm to get strength and a strength ring to get even more strength 
Um, there's advanced machinery, so it's just some more machines you can craft, and these are all wireless and require a power core. Um, there are uh, ore trees, so if you can get uh, dirt, which I think if you sieve um, gravel, you have a chance to get dirt pebbles. Um, or just dirt, I forget, but you can get dirt from sieving gravel, and you can sieve dirt for saplings, and you can grow an oak sapling if you want, or you can grow these saplings to get wood if some of the recipes require wood. Um, and you can also, uh, like, make a diamond sapling to get wood and diamonds and stuff. And there is item exchange, which is like a better version of Element Exchange. Uh, there's more TNT, and there's custom enchantments um, with the over enchantment table. Um, there's survival guns, so you can make like a mining gun if you want. Um, there's the magic add-on, that's what you start with, a magic orb and a wand. Um, there's draconic evolution, uh, blood magic, machinery weapons. Um, there's Calamity, and you can craft, inside of the Key Crafter, uh, you can craft um, the pedestals, kind of like in Sky Factory, so you don't have to go explore for them because they don't spawn in the stone world. And uh, there's music weapons, there's nether expansion, uh, pet crates, and parasites that can spawn if it gets really dark. Um, and yeah, that's basically all of the stuff that gets added from my add-ons. You can also add some other add-ons from the suggest suggested add-ons if you want as well. Um, but yeah, that's basically it. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this update. Uh, there's from the, I haven't updated Sky, uh, Stone Factory in a long time, so from the last update, there's been a lot of new uh, items added and new machines and stuff. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.